Hey Andrew here for tabletblog.de. I'm still at Asus and now we want to take a closer look at the new Asus Transformer Book Duet TD300. It's a new Ultrabook convertible, however you want to call it, and it's actually quite interesting because it runs Android and Windows 8.1. So it has specs like a normal Ultrabook. Inside is an Intel Core i3, i5, or i7 processor, as well as 4 gigab gigabyte of memory and 64 or 128 gigabyte SSD. But inside the dock there's an um, actual real hard drive, not an SSD, a normal hard drive. And you, you can get that with 320, 500, 750 or 1 terabyte. So you've got quite some op options and if you go very high I'm sure you will pay quite a lot for this design. So let's quickly go around the device. This is a 13.3 inch display. The resolution is uh, 1366 by 768. So it's not full HD but 720p at least. Then we've got a webcam here on the top, nothing else. And if you go to the side here, we've got nothing. And on the bottom, we've got a Windows button. Then the ports for the keyboard dock. Then we've got here the power plug, a headset port, and nothing here. Then on the top, we've got a couple of fans because we've got a Core i processor inside. Then we've got a power button, a walker switch for the volume, and nothing on the other side, and no camera on the back. I mean, you don't need it with a 13.3 inch device. It's actually quite heavy in one hand, um, but with those specs, it couldn't be a much lighter. So let's go around the keyboard dock. As you've seen, we've got no USB ports on the tablet itself, but we've got a USB 2.0 on this side and a USB 3.0 port on the other side. There's also an Ethernet connector, a power plug and an HDMI out. Nothing on the back. It's a standard Chiclet keyboard that we know from other Ultrabooks from Asus and there we've got the little Android key to switch between the operating systems. Okay, this is a quick hands-on with the Asus Transformer Book Duet TD300. I'm Andre for tabletblog.de. Thanks for watching. Then Paul.